Utilization of Tomato Pumice as Livestock Feed Tomatoes procured from the farms are brought to the food processing plants in tractor trolleys or plastic crates. Tomatoes in the trolley are flushed with water and unloaded in a water channel, while tomatoes from the crates are transferred manually to the water channel. The tomatoes are washed thoroughly with water containing 3-5% to sodium hypochloride. Thereafter, washing is given by a water jet spray. Tomatoes then go to the sorting line, where damaged, rotten and green tomatoes, if any, are removed manually. Then these are transferred to juicer and extractor, where tomatoes are cut into pieces and juice and pulp are extracted. After extracting the juice and pulp, the leftover material is called tomato pomace containing tomato peels, seed and residual pulp which is then taken out of the plant by a conveyor belt and collected in a tractor trolley kept under the hopper. It constitutes 2 to 2.5 percent of the tomatoes used for processing. Tomato pomace can be used fresh or after sun drying as a component of total mixed ration for ruminants. Feeding fresh tomato pomace Fresh tomato pomace contains around 40% dry matter and 19% crude protein on dry matter basis. It is a rich source of lycopene and is highly nutritious. Fresh tomato pomace is mixed with available green fodder in 50-50 ratio, supplemented with mineral mixture, common salt and other feed supplements and fed as total mixed ration to the ruminants. Ensiling Fresh Tomato Pomace Fresh tomato pomace and green maize fodder containing about 25% dry matter are mixed in 70-30 ratio to obtain 34-35% to dry matter required for making good silage. Green maize fodder is spread on a clean concrete floor and then fresh tomato pomace is spread on the green fodder and mixed thoroughly. A 10 to 12 feet long low density polyethylene tube of 4 to 6 feet diameter one side of which is tied with a nylon string is used as a tube silo for making silage. The uniform mixture of fresh tomato pomace and green maize fodder is transferred into the tube silo with simultaneous manual pressing. After thorough pressing, the polyethylene tube is tied with a nylon string at the top end and left for 42 days in siling. After the completion of ensiling period, the tomato pomace maize fodder silage can be fed to the animals at the rate of 25% on dry matter basis in total mixed ration. Utilization of sun-dried tomato pomace The fresh tomato pomace is sun-dried on a clean concrete floor or by spreading on polyethylene sheet. The sun-dried ground tomato pomace has 18 to 19.5% crude protein and is used to replace 50 to 100% concentrate mixture containing 19% crude protein.
total mixed ration is made by mixing the tomato pomace concentrate mixture and green fodder in 25 is to 25 is to 50 ratio. or tomato pomace and green fodder in 50-50 ratio on dry matter basis. The tomato pomace and green maize fodder mixture is fed to sheep, goat, cows and buffaloes. The animals relish the tomato pomace based total mixed ration. The sun-dried ground tomato pomace, kino waste and empty pea pods are mixed with green fodder in 25 is to 25 is to 25 is to 25 ratio on dry matter basis and can be fed to animals as a total mixed ration. The animals relish the tomato pomace, kino waste and empty pea pods based total mixed ration.